After a five-season tenure aimed at resurrecting Tennessee's women's basketball program, Kelly Harper's chapter with the Lady Vols has come to a close. Athletic Director Danny White made the announcement on Monday, just a week following the team's exit from the NCAA tournament at the hands of NC State, where they fell 79-72 in the second round. Acknowledging the difficulty of the decision, White praised Harper's contributions, highlighting her legacy as a three-time national champion student-athlete. Despite her profound dedication and love for Tennessee, the inability to clinch significant victories against top-tier opponents and break past the Sweet 16 barrier led to her dismissal. Harper's tenure, though marked by improvements, ultimately fell short of restoring the program's former glory following the retirement and passing of legendary coach Pat Summit. While her overall record was commendable, standing at 108-52 with a conference record of 53-24, the inability to secure key wins and advance deep into postseason play contributed to her departure. The decision comes with financial implications, as Harper, under contract until April 14, 2028, is owed a significant sum of $2,222,916 due to being terminated without cause. Despite the setback, Harper expressed gratitude for the opportunity to lead her alma mater's team and mentor its players both on and off the court. Throughout her tenure, Harper navigated various challenges, including key injuries to star players like Rikia Jackson, which disrupted the team's momentum early in the season. Despite moments of promise, including a near upset against number one South Carolina, the Lady Vols struggled to consistently perform against formidable opponents. Recruitment struggles also plagued Harper, with a notable decline in high school signings in recent years, impacting the team's depth and resilience. While Harper produced several WNBA draft picks during her tenure, including four first-round selections, the team's performance remained inconsistent, particularly against ranked opponents. Reflecting on her tenure, Harper's most successful season came in 2021-22 where the Lady Vols secured their first trip to the Sweet 16 since 2016 and briefly ascended into the top five of national rankings. Despite moments of promise, persistent injury woes and recruitment challenges hindered sustained success. Harper's departure marks the end of a chapter in Tennessee women's basketball history, as the program now embarks on an aggressive search for its next leader. While her tenure may not have yielded the desired results, Harper's commitment to the program and her efforts to restore its competitive edge will be remembered as a significant chapter in Lady Vols basketball.